Hi, my name is Leroy Harbach. I'm a senior instructor for the CMC Rescue School. And today we're gonna to take a look at some of the various gate options uh, from CMC on both the ProTech and the Pro Series carabiners. First one is just an oval carabiner, a non-locking gate. The next one is the screw lock carabiner. On the screw lock, there's a visual indicator so you can tell if the carabiner is all the way closed or not. If you see the skull and crossbones on the side, obviously you know that the carabiner is not locked. Another option Similar to the auto lock is the manual lock. The manual lock carabiners stay in the open rigging position until you physically close the gate. There's a visual indicator on the side, skull and crossbones on the, on the sight windows that tell you if the carabiner is open. And I've got a couple of different methods for being able to lock it off. You can pull down on the gate and it turns and locks the carabiner into place. Or if I push down with my finger, that will also lock that carabiner up. The auto lock carabiner is one that's going to stay in the locked position until I physically open it and as soon as I let it go it's going to spin and lock itself into place. So to open it I need to pull down twist the gate to the open configuration, make my connection, and as soon as I let go, the gate is self-locking. Another option on the ProTac carabiners, on the auto-locking carabiners, is this captive eye. Captive eye can be used on a strap um, or a piece of webbing that you don't want to disconnect. It's held in place by a set screw and the gate operates the exact same way.